Andre Ward tells Teofimo Lopez, you know what? Don't take my word for it. Roll the tape. You don't get what's fair. You get what you negotiate. So he, he, don't pocket watch Devin Haney. Mm -hmm. Devin Haney and Bill Haney, they're doing their thing. They're getting paid. You got to go to your team and you got you to ask the tough questions. And if you need to make some change, you got to do that. So you can't get mad at the game. The game's only going to give you what you negotiate. And well, Andre Ward, he tells Teofimo Lopez to stop pocket watching Devin Haney. And see, the thing is, the thing that's more interesting about this is that Andre Ward told Teofimo Lopez that he needs to go back to his team and he needs to readjust his situation with them if he feels or believes that he's being underpaid or underutilized in the sport of boxing. But Andre Ward is the same fighter that told Sean Porter on Twitter that a fighter should basically have an opportunity to sit at the table. That's what he said. His quote basically was, fighters have worked so hard to sit at the table. And that was Andre Ward criticizing Sp uh, Porter because Porter basically was telling Crawford that he needed to have people around him, you know, build a team to be able to understand the concept of business and especially to negotiate with someone of the magnitude of this fight and with Al Heyman. So there's a confusion here. On one hand, Ward criticized Porter because Porter gave Crawford some good advice and having a good team around him. But then on the other hand, he tells uh, Teofimo Lopez he needs to go back to his team if he feel like he's being underpaid. And if it and if and if whoever doesn't like it in his camp or team, or if it's basically not um a legitimate response to Lopez questioning his team or manager or whoever, then maybe he need to let that manager or representation go. And so what happens is we see here that fighters they pick and choose when they want to say something based on popularity. Because Crawford is popular, Ward basically stuck up for him when Porter came at Crawford about not having good representation. But here he is coming at Teofimo Lopez because Teofimo Lopez do, does have representation. Whether it be good or bad, we don't know. But my point is that we have to call it spade a spade in the sport of boxing. And so here we have Andre Ward telling Lopez, stop pocket watching Haney. And quite frankly, I agree. No fighter should be pocket watching someone else's bag, basically, or money or compensation because you don't know uh, what's documented on black and white as far as an agreement that that fighter may have with networks, promoters, and or managers, et cetera. Um, but I just found it interesting that Andre Ward would be the one to tell Lopez basically to stop pocket watching and go to your own team and work out the kinks of uh, your representation when he basically criticized Sean Porter for telling Crawford to basically do the same thing, you know, have good representation. So I just thought that was a little contradictory. Uh, but uh, the truth of the matter is that Teofimo Lopez, he has a big fight happening uh, this evening. And because he has a big fight happening this evening, all the lights, camera, and action is going to be on him because they're fighting at the Mecca of boxing, Madison Square Garden. And he does have a, a, a fighter there that's not willing to lay down uh, for him. So he does, he, does, he does have a little, you know, a little competition that he has to be concerned about this evening. But we shall see. I'm Manager Marty. Till next time.